Hello everybody, I'm out again. See what we can see. Got the door running out with me. So I'm gonna have a little look around here. There's the cemetery there. Just walking down this side path at the minute just to have a little look. Here's some photos and that as well. So I'm gonna walk down and have a look, see what we can see down here. I know there's churches, but I won't be going in the churches because how to respect for the people who are at rest. Uh, the families, the workers of who looks after the cemetery and I believe there's a Facebook group as well called Friends of Valence and Sanity so I'll mark and respect for them, I won't be going in these old churches I'll just look around the outside I don't think it'd be right me walking in people are looking after places, you know people are like that effort into looking after these I know the churches are in a bad way inside they're old, you know, but still, I don't want to get into trouble with anybody and, you know, even if there's a door open, I won't be going in. There's a window broken, I might put the camera up so you, you can see it. But I won't be going in the churches up here. It's going to get me a bite. I'll just keep going and have a look down this path. I see some great graves along there, look at that. This place is cracker. I know it's a graveyard, yeah, it's a cemetery, but. There's one of the churches over there. Yeah, I'll go around with them. Going over the hall. Pretty much in a line, sort of thing. You'll see what's over there. I'm leaving my camera on autofocus as well because it's a nuisance trying to focus with this sometimes. I've got my drone with me. I want to put it up at some point. Have you seen this tree and the leaves on it? I've never seen anything like this before. Look at that. <laughs> What's that? What's that? Strange that, isn't it? Very strange tree. I've seen it like that before. I never had. Oh. Seen this, everybody? Well, this is where, at some point leading up to Halloween, is where I'm gonna come up and spend a few hours on my own. Hello, everybody, I'm out again because all them clips you just see, it's a new day. I've got my new trainees on, and I've come out again because I didn't get quite enough as well I needed yesterday, so I'm gonna show you a bit more. I'm gonna try and find Ken and Silla's grave. We had a look on YouTube before I come out before. I know where it is now. Don't know where Ken's is, but I can only give it a go. Try and find her. But if not, we'll have a look around anyway because I've got plans for Halloween up here. So I need to come up and give it a little and have a look at the churches and that. I'm not going in now to mark respect to the people. I look after it and that. I think it'll be right. But we can see when you have a look. I'll come up to the Saturday today so Maybe more people here. I don't, I don't like. I feel like I've been student, you know. I'm gonna have a bloody big camera in my hand. Anyway, we'll give it a go. I'm gonna head down there. You never guess what? I never brought the clip out for the top of there, look. So I can't put my camera on it. It's on the other camera. I had that out last night. As I was out last night. Oh, I haven't transferred them over. Never mind. Right, this is one of the churches. And the gargoyles on the top, the thing is. Yeah. It just looks a bit on top, you know, walking around. Because I know they've had problems with people up here going into these churches and that. And I'm just not going to do that today. But still it looks... Oh! Look, the door's open, so... You know, it's not been open. No, it's not. It's shut. It should be shut as well. Yeah. 
Look at all that, the 1909, I think they said about the, the cemetery itself being opened. Oh, look at that. <laughs> There's three of them, they're more or less on the line, although the big one is a little bit more offset. See the way look, they pull the board back to be trying to get in, it's not on is it? If there's no access, there's no access, it's as simple as that. You're not breaking in. You have rules and you've got to keep to them. I like that one. Oh, look up. Still is over there somewhere, I'll go and have a look. There's the other church, the one in the middle. See the other one's just there. There you go everybody, our cellar. What a legend, eh? Hey cellar. Yeah, I'll leave her. Leave it in me. I don't think it's right, you know. It's not like a cabin, it's not a grave. It's just it's not normal. I don't think so. I'll carry on. Yeah. There's something I've never seen before. A water log grave. Just there. Nowhere else. Just there. I'm trying to stay out of people's way anymore. It's the best I can, like. Because I want to find somewhere where I can talk to you. I still haven't found Ken Dodge, I don't know where it is. I walked around the big square there before and I couldn't see it. I really don't like doing it though, you know, it doesn't feel like with me. I was never going to walk around the back of there before, down the back of that path. It brought me out, no way. Nice little footpath. And this is actually still part of the cemetery, so it's up the top back way. This is the little path, I just want to see where it goes. Talk with you in a bit as well and give you an update of where I'm up to. I've got some crackers coming up for you for Halloween, which is half the reason why I've come up here today. No idea where that goes. Oh, down here. Yeah, I've got some crackers coming up for Halloween. I'll speak to you about that in a bit. Oh, it's heady. Walk down here on a dark night. I would. There is the height of laziness and disrespect. Look at that. What's the point in picking your dog muck up, putting it in a bag, and then hanging from with from a tree? Whoa, look at that, man, a tree. What's that? What do you mean, you wish you were in a tree? Maybe someone's been doing a bit of yeah, spooky stuff here. Maybe it's just something as simple as a scout or some type of club, on it? The spooky woods. There's a big football match going on in the distance, I don't know if you can hear it. See there's another like little sit off thingy, so he's like a little bummy there though. One for you. Oh, 
Can you reach the square? Purposely built. Yeah, someone's been camping down here or something, haven't they? I'm trying to. Another one. Someone's actually got bricks in the corner, look like a little fireplace. <laughs> and a doorway, see where the door's been here. A little hut. Yeah. Someone's had an idea. I didn't hear the noise. I'll walk over now and right into the middle of a football field with a bloody big camera in my hands. Hello. I don't know what's going on over there, but they're having murder with each other. Apparently, the ones in green are winning 60 mil. And the ones that are playing in purple and pink. Do you like There's a lot of Georges on that bed. Mm. Hey, I hope there's not the arm on the arm. Thinking he's uh, Kenny Daglish. I know he's known for this. <laughs> yeah, the pub kicking off. Get over here and say, just kick the ball, fella, and shut up. Have you seen what I've just walked out of? I've just come out up there. This is where I done the video with him. There was a dead dog. He must be working on that look. <coughs> it is. This is where I done my video the other week. Wow, look at all the leaves. I'm not going down there because I know where it goes. That's the compound there that I've done a while back. The dead dog there. I didn't realise it led up to where I am now. Right, let me just give you a little bit of information on this place. A little time before I come out. Grade 2 listed, 150 acres, established 1909. It's got 399 Commonwealth graves in it. 2003. 74,109 graves. Single died in 2015, June 11, 1958. Uh, George Edward Nurse, 1945, he got the uh, VC. He's buried there. Sick Hen Dog, 2018. Possibly the third largest in Europe at 70. Uh, the church is found here disuse in about 1975. The big church is Angli Anglican, the other one is Roman Catholic and then the other one is Nonconformist. So that's a little bit on this place. What am I going to be doing? Oh, no. Yeah, so just let me give you a little update on what I'm doing. I'm going to be coming up to here. I'm going to do a three-part Halloween. I've got some stuff coming off Amazon tomorrow. And EF EFM meter, two of the ones we recorder as well, or you can record ghost sounds on it. Um, I don't really normally do this stuff, the paranormal stuff, but I'll give this a go. So what I'm going to do, I've got this graveyard, another one, and another one to do, and I'm going to come down on my own at night, sit off. I've got somewhere in there where I can sit off. The second one, I know where it is, and I've been down there when I was younger, and even during the day it's spooky, it's uh, where the graves are, it's really unkept. Big holes everywhere. Uh, the graves have actually sunk it in, in like squares, stuff like that. Uh, really uneven ground, and really spooky. So I'm gonna go down there to the back bit as well, and sit off on my own. I'll bring them with me, and I'll put, I'll set everything up. So see what we can get, and uh, I'll do that at the three different locations. Should be fun. I'll test myself as well. I, I, it doesn't really bother me doing this, you know what I mean? I don't get afraid of it, ghosts and all that sort of stuff, it just doesn't bother me, but you never know. I know the second one, I'm a little bit apprehensive about that because I've been down before, so I'll go down and give it a go and, you know, go down on my own, unless uh, Evan Paranormal wants to come with me, that is no key. Um, I might go down with him, do that one, 
But yeah, I'll go down and give it a go. I'll sit the meters with me and see what we get on now. See if we get any recordings. Uh, and, uh, but I'll be going up to do this one as soon as. Because I want these three done as soon as I can get them done. And uh, because I've got a lot of work to do on them, I know that. A lot of prep and that. And uh, a lot of editing. So I just thought I'd come down and take these out with me today, yesterday and yesterday. Uh, I'll just show you around them Allerton 70. I didn't want to go in the chases, I didn't feel right. I couldn't find Ken Dodd's grave, you know. So I'll go back and put this little bit up for you. It just keeps you keeps me in contact with you to so let you know where I'm, I'm up to. Because of the restrictions and murder at the minute, you know. Quite right as well, I suppose. That's why I can't get down to Downcaster or anywhere like that to do anything. Because, you know, I spoke to the police yesterday about me coming up here and they were sound with it. You know, it's always good to tell them, especially when you do videos and stuff, so you don't get yourself into trouble. But yeah, I don't know where this goes. I have no intentions of finding out. Yeah, uh, it's getting on now, so I'm gonna get back, try and make this little video for you, so you know what I'm up to. So yeah, these these Halloween ones, I make them as best as I can. I've got my new top as well. I'm sure if you're on my Facebook forum, you've seen it. So I'll go and give them a go. I might order a few other little bits off Amazon as well. Uh, to take with me. So this one, this will just be here. Record meters out. And go. I'll give it about half an hour, any longer than that. There's no point because you just hear me blah blah blah, sitting there looking at. You know, I'm, I light things up around the grave so you can see. If you see anything? I'll set my GoPro up. So we'll have the GoPro in one corner, the other camera in one corner, and this is the main. So we've got three ways of spotting things. I'll put one behind me as well. I'll sit off up there for half an hour and see what we get. Anyway, I'm going to put this together, so I'll keep an eye out for it. Um, please like, please subscribe, leave a comment. Stay safe. I'll see you very, very soon for these. Take it easy, and I'll see you again. Hello everybody, just before you go, I want to show you something because I got my stuff off Amazon today, because I'm going up to do one of the cemeteries in a bit. I've just been editing the video, you should just see it. As a matter of fact, it's not finished yet, but you have, you have seen it now. I still got to put the end bit on it, uh, so I'm going to do that while my batteries are charging up. So I just wanted to show you what I got from Amazon, that I'm going to take up later. That one there is the EFM tester, test electricity and static electricity, there's the stuff about it there. I'm going to have a read of the instructions before I go up of course. It does work because I've just had it next to the fan and it went off proper. And then this one here is this digital recorder, how small is that? It's tiny thing, it's so light. And that records strange voices, or any voices, but it's voice activated. Where I'm going, it's going to be quiet, there's only going to be me there. And I'm not going to be talking to you very much because we obviously we have to listen out for things. And uh, it records things, so if I'm being quiet, that will automatically go off if there's a voice very close. You know, so I'll go up later and take it. Take them up with me and give them a go. She's not coming with me. Are you so? Right. <laughs> so I'll go up and give it a go, see what happens. I don't really do it, but uh, it's the one, the next one I'm going to do that I'm worried about. Because I know it, so that should be fun. Uh, so we'll go up tonight. Keep your eye out for it, because it'll going to be out soon, because I've got three to do. So I'll go and give this a go later on. Stay safe. Take it easy, keep your eye out, and I'll see you very, very soon for this part one.